Montvale Baptist Church devotional for Friday, September 11th, 2020 from Call to Glory. Do not be deceived, God is not mocked. For whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. Galatians 6, 7 My wife and I were sitting on our patio enjoying a warm, sunny afternoon when she pointed out a spider scurrying across the patio floor. My wife does not like spiders. So implicit in her pointing out to me was the command, squash it. Well, like most men, I like to make a game out of things, so I went over and I put my foot down about six or eight inches ahead of the spider's path. Expecting it to turn and scurry in another direction, I was surprised when instead it rushed headlong toward my shoe and actually jumped at it. Then it turned and hurried off in a different direction. I put my foot down again in its path, and again undaunted it attacked my shoe. Well, this time, at least it get away, and I incur the displeasure of my wife, I squashed it. It was not that big of a spider, but it was feisty. I certainly was not afraid to attack it, and it certainly was not afraid to attack something that was many times larger than it was. And then, because nothing happened to it the first time, it attacked again to its own demise. Later, I got to thinking about the spider and how it reminds me of the foolishness of many men and their lack of fear in mocking God by living a life of disrespect for Him. They reject the gospel of repentance toward God and faith toward our Lord Jesus Christ and ignore the warnings of Hebrews 9.27. And because they are not stuck, struck with lightning or such, they think that God doesn't hear or care what they do. They are like that spider, showing no fear, not realizing that the shoe could drop down at any time. Read the warning given in the Old Testament in Ecclesiastes 8, 11, and 12. Our Heavenly Father, help us to understand that when we sin and we disrespect you and just because we're not punished immediately nothing happens to us right away we think we get by with it and we just turn and become more bold in our sinfulness help us to realize that sin is sin and that it removes us from you it moves us away from you and hurts us father convict our hearts today in jesus name amen